Hey there, it's Ilze B. I am a Latvian and I teach Latvian to English speakers. I know that there are many of you who want to learn Latvian, but you think that it is really difficult and probably not possible. That is not true. I actually calculated how fast you can learn Latvian and you can read about it on my blog post. It's called How Fast Can You Learn Latvian? It's posted on my website ilzeb.com. I argue that if you learn four words at every day for nine months and then you also learn some grammar for three months, then within a year you would be able to speak Latvian quite well. So this is what I want to contribute with. Today is February the 1st, 2018. It's the first day of the second month of a year. And I thought I would use this day to do something really important. Each day, starting from today for a month, let's begin with a month, I will teach you four words. And I will teach you them in sentences or in phrases so that you can use them. I will teach you also the default forms of those words but I will not teach you other forms that are out of those phrases and that are not the default forms. And then let's see how your vocabulary gradually builds up and you can start speaking Latvian. Shall we do that? I challenge you. Let's do it. I will teach you as if you didn't know any Latvian. I'm sure you know some words, but I don't know what you know. So I will teach you as if your knowledge was totally zero. And every day I will teach you new words, but time after time I will also help you to revise the words that I had taught you previously. I think it will be a great challenge to all of us, to me too. For me it will be important to not teach you the same word several times, so I will have to take notes. I will teach you words in small sentences or phrases. There will be no more than four words in each phrase. Or, if there are more in the upcoming lessons or days, then those would be the words that I have already taught you before. So, those would not be new words for you. You would only revise them. And that's good for you, because thus you will reinforce your knowledge in your memory. And today, the phrase that I would like to teach you is Es esmu savās mājās. I spoke it rather quickly, like a Latvian would speak. And if you have watched my previous video lessons, you might have noticed that I talk about language rhythm and about accents. And first, before I teach you each word separately, I will teach you the rhythm of this phrase. The rhythm consists of the so-called feet. One foot is either one syllable and a pause, or two syllables, or three syllables. There will be no more than three syllables in one foot. And each syllable can be either stressed or not stressed. And how I will teach you the rhythm with these words is that the word yes will mean the stressed syllable and the word no will mean the unstressed syllable. And the rhythm of that phrase that I want you to learn is like this. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. So I will pronounce the phrase again and try to count syllables. Es esmu savas mājās. How many syllables did you count? I'll pronounce it again. Es esmu savās mājās. I counted seven syllables. I'll pronounce it again. Es esmu savās mājās. And what do you think is the first syllable? Stressed or unstressed? I'll pronounce it again. Es esmu savās mājās. It is unstressed. So the rhythm of this phrase is like this. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. So it starts 
with the unstressed syllable no and it also ends with the unstressed syllable also no. I'll tell you the rhythm again. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Can you repeat that after me? Let's try to do it together. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Let's do it again. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. And again. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. And now just you. And we all together again. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. All right, and now the phrase. And I will start with the last word in the phrase. And that last word is mayas. The first syllable is stressed and the second syllable is unstressed. And I will pronounce the word again. Mayas. Now let's pronounce it together. Mayas. And one more time. Mayas. Now I will pronounce the word that is before the word mayas. And that word is savas. I'll pronounce it again. Savas. And one more time. Savas. And now I will pronounce the two words together. Savas mayas. Can we do it together? Let's do it. Savas mayas. And one more time. Savas mayas. And now I will pronounce the word that stands before the word savas. And that word is asmo. I'll pronounce it again. Asmo. Can you repeat it together with me? Let's do it. Asmo. Asmo. And one more time. Asmo. And now I will pronounce all three words together. Asmo savas mayas. I'll do it again. Listen carefully. Asmo savas mayas. I'll do it again. Asmo savas mayas. And now you'll see it on the screen. Asmo savas mayas. And now let's do it together. Asmo savas mayas. One more time. Asmo savas mayas. And now we need to learn one more word. And that word is only one syllable long. And that word is s. S is an easy word, isn't it? So I think that I can pronounce all the phrase together. S. Es mo savas mayas. Es es mo savas mayas. Es es mo savas mayas. And you see it written how it looks in Latvian. And let's do it together now. Es es mo savas mayas. And this phrase means I am at my home. Let's do it again. Let's pronounce it together. Es esmu savas mājās. So the last word is mājās, which means at home. And the word before that means my, but it can also mean your or his. It depends on the sentence, which I'm explaining in my Latvian language course, Latvian for English speakers. Here I'm just teaching you a phrase and the meaning that the word has in this phrase. So, savas mayas means at my home. Savas mayas, at my home. Asmo means am. So, we want to uh, say it together with the word I, which is s. Es asmo. Es asmo means I am. Es Asmo. Es asmo. And savas mayas means at my home. And together, es asmo savas mayas means I am at my home. I'll pronounce it again. Es asmo savas mayas. And one more time. 
Es esmu savās mājās. Did you learn it? I hope you did. I will prepare a downloadable PDF file that will be either above this video or below this video. And you can also watch the video again and revise it at home. So, I think it will be fun. You will learn so much. Just stay with me for this one month. You will gain so much. Bye till tomorrow. And here are the default forms. Asmu, the default form is boot. Savas, the default form is savs. And mayas, the default form is maya. S was already in its default form.